What is going on everybody, it is Starkler coming back at you with another Corporate Clash video and today I am going to be fighting the Deep Diver, which is the Kudos Street Manager for Barnacle Boatyard, and unfortunately I do not have him on my list of board bots, I even tried doing my little strategy where I actively seek it out on the streets and then I fight the cog and then run away, but unfortunately it didn't work, it didn't show up in my sticker book because I think you have to actually finish fighting the cog completely before you can get it in your book. If you have not bought the Duck Shuffler plushie yet, you're starting to run out of time because it is the 5th at the time of me recording this and it will stop on the 7th. So we'll see if this video even comes out by then. Maybe I'm saying this for nothing, maybe the campaign closed by then, but we'll see. But anyways, I do not see any groups for the Deep Diver yet, so I guess I'm just gonna have to make one myself. And again, I'm doing it on Marty because I don't have any cosmetics for it on Marty, so if I could take that one little chance at finding some sort of cosmetic on it while also having access to, to tune up on this tune, it would be quite nice. So I'm going to keep searching for it, and as soon as I find the Deep Diver, I will cut away and we will start to fight it. Also, I think I'll probably fight it twice just because the boss fights are usually pretty short, so just... Hang in there, and we'll see if we can find it. Okay, so good news. Uh, one in four chance of picking all the streets, and I actually found the deep diver on this specific s street in particular. And I think it's a sheik. I think all the cogs are like she's or something. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, we just need one more person to join, and then we can fight the deep diver. So we're very close. We just need one more. Yeah, we're just kind of waiting for one more tune to join. We're just slowly walking down the street. And now we got Sabrina coming over to me. That's nice. We just need one more, dudes. How many people are on right now? 346. That's not a lot. The question is, is there really going to be one more person that wants to fight the Deep Diver? We might be here for a while. She just teleported away. That is not good. Okay. We have found her. Hopefully they teleport. Let's see if they teleport. Found her. I will say TP. There we go. Jeez, like everybody just shows up all at once like that. I'm being surrounded right now. I hope everybody makes it. Hi. Hi everybody. We have found the deep diver. I was like, yeah it was. It was Anchor Avenue. Everybody's showing up. We just need one more. There we go. Okay. So we are finally fighting the Deep Diver. And again, I'm not sure if the Deep Diver underwent any sort of changes or not, because I know there were some recent changes that went down, but we'll find out. So, let's see. Okay, so they're going to take out those cogs. I'm just going to use a bowling ball, because bowling balls do lots of damage. Now, just to put for the record, I've never dropped a bowling ball on someone's head in real life, and I don't encourage that type of behavior, and that just messed great. But, I think it could damage a cog pretty well. I know, I know, right? Anna, honey, sweetie, please, what? Okay, bowling ball. That's gotta hurt. That's gotta hurt big time. Hit us with your water cooling abilities. Oh no, that missed though. The rocket. That, that mouse has like style. Like he really does. He's got like his purple vest, he's got his bow tie, his glasses. Yeah, there's the deep diver. <laughs> Funny enough. Yeah, like how does the deep diver dive like into like solid. What, what is it, a boardwalk, like solid wood, cardboard? Like, you're walking along, like, on top of the water. Has anyone ever considered that? Because I just thought about that now. Like, uh, oh wait, oh, okay. Okay, I'm just gonna... Oh, what's that person doing here? Very strange. Okay... Oh, maybe I should have done something else. Oh, wait. Oh, the other gags go first. I didn't realize that. 
So, so yeah, when it comes to like Barnacle Boatyard and Donald's Dock, them both being the same playground pretty much, have you ever considered the, the idea that we're just walking on top of water on like boards and planks? Because I just thought of that now. Quit attacking my friends, stop it. I'm, gonna, I'm probably gonna heal and do a group healing. So we can use it. Bike horn. No, we gotta, we gotta use the whistles. You gotta blow them hard with those whistles, you know what I'm saying? That doesn't sound weird, weird at all, does it? Doesn't sound weird? Oh. Useless. Yeah, I have prestige tune-up on this tune, that means I get healed extra for what I do. 32, wait. Was that one tune that used sound, or was that two tunes? I don't know. Okay, um, so you're gonna use that. Okay, this will work. We'll self-heal a tiny bit, and we'll do good damage. Lock. Come on, lock it in. Uh, okay, alright, that's fine, that works. That's okay. I think throw self heals for everyone, doesn't it? Prestige lure. Oh, that was, that was actually pretty good. She's covered in, like, cream pie slice fudge. Uh, can we all just... I don't know, can we just use sound? There was a big cheese invasion? <laughs> I didn't even know there was a big cheese invasion. There was an old video I saw on YouTube um, called I Summoned a Big Cheese Invasion, and some tune was just sitting in Donald's Dreamland, and he... Uh, oh, that's pretty good, actually. Maybe I could use, like, a group lure. Oh, wait. Let's just go for it. I think that might be GG if that lure hits. But yeah, that was an old video. Like, some tune just summons a big cheese invasion, and that's it. It's in a populated district, too. Is that it? Okay, we got her. That's it. That is... That's our first take on the Deep Diver. I think I might fight the boss just one more time because the boss fights are usually <laughs> really short-lived, but um, I'll, I'll probably do it one more time just for you guys. We just need to finish off these cogs. They should probably just use sound just to, I don't know, finish it off. Don't aim for that one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, people are posting stickers. Where's my feather? Yeah, my feather better sticker. <laughs> Got it on the first try. That is really funny. That's like a story in of itself. So let's see if we get any drops. I wanna, I wanna get some drops. Okay. I did not get any drops, sadly. But that is. I, I don't. I think that's it. I, I think she's in my book now. So let me check. Do I have the deep diver? I do. So, yeah, there's two different uh, bits of loot you can get. You can get the sticker, and you can get the boots. And I've defeated her once. So, you know what? I think I'm going to go and fight her just one more time if there's any groups that exist. There aren't any, so I'm going to have to make a group for the Deep Diver. So, anyways, I'm going to go find another uh, group that's willing to do this, and I will cut away, and let's see if we can have another successful run of the Deep Diver. You know what? I like this guy. This is... This is the real... This is... <laughs> I like this guy. He's just walking along with the Deep Diver. Keep that strut going, man. We'll just do it together. How do I... Is there, like, a walk key? How do I walk? I don't know how to walk. Just, I don't know, let him do it. Let the roach do it. The cockroach. A cockroach will walk with it. You know, come to think of it, that might actually be a good choice to just follow the deep diver like that. But we have a full group, so maybe we can just fight her, and I think we're good. Is that everyone? That might be everyone. 
So we have Ricky the Mouse, Roach, and Grumpy Wendy. Okay, Grumpy Wendy, nice to meet you. Wait, I was just like, wait, I have Prestige Lure. Wait, what, what, what does Wendy have? Oh, let's see. Oh, okay, alright, yeah, okay. We'll just let Wendy do it, but at the same time, I wish Wendy would have said something so I didn't have to manually check. Oh, you've got to be joking. That's a rough start, dude. It's okay. We have tune-ups. Oh my gosh. What a rough start, dude. Did we do any damage to the deep diver? Uh, maybe I shouldn't say anything. We did, a, we did a fair amount of damage. We took away like a fourth of the health. Sometimes people could be a little slow with their choices. Does Wendy have access to Speed Chat Plus? They haven't said anything. Wendy. Is Wendy a guy? I don't even know anymore because they got rid of, like, gender in this game. Like, you don't really choose between a boy or a girl. It's just, like... You just pick whatever you want to put on your tune. No, not the roach. Totally not robots. And meanwhile, roach walks like a robot. <laughs> I don't know, can we just use sound? Or maybe I should just keep using tune-up. I gotta keep my teammates alive. I've got prestige tune-up. So it heals me a little bit. Wait, a very tight squeeze for what? Yeah, Wendy seems to be having some problems with communication. <laughs> well, there always seems to be something happening. Oh no. Yeah, you see, we need some communication up in here. That's what we need. I mean, I can keep using tune-ups. I'll just say sound. Wendy does not have access. She does have a he, she. It's the name is Wendy, so they do have access to sound. We said sound. Come on, you gotta listen to us. I mean, it's better than nothing, but that tuna probably should have gone to the mouse who was lower on laugh. But you see now why I wanted to do more than one boss fight because sometimes they go, some go better than the others. I think it's good to show the complications that can arise during a boss fight, so at least people know how to recover from them. Um, but, you know, it's just the way it is. Wendy can lure, the rest can just drop bowling balls. Come on, Wendy! Yeah, there you go, you're doing it right. There you go. Do you come from Wendy's? Do you, like, make soft serve and burgers and fries? Uh, don't make my people hungry now. We don't want hungry, hungry viewers. Uh, lure, throw, wait... There we go. And of course, Wendy is gonna use a group lure, I'm assuming. And instead they use a sound. I think this might be a half-hearted troll or someone with a very low IQ. I'm sorry, but... Come on. If you use... If Wendy had used the lure right there... Right there... That would have been it. That would have been it for the Deep Diver. And now the Deep Diver is probably gonna dive. Ah, oh, Wendy... If the Deep Diver dives, oh my gosh, no way. If Wendy had used a lure right there, that would have been it. I don't know why Wendy decided not to. I feel miserable. So what's Wendy going to do? Is Wendy going to use a lure? Alright, I guess I'll lure then. I'm just... <laughs> That's very confusing. This could have gone so much smoother if we had some communication. <sighs> Does it say forbidden Wendy sounds? Very confusing. Oh, this is a slow day. There we go. Wendy's doing the right thing. There you go. Would have been a lot nicer if Wendy had just... You know, I've said it enough. I said what I needed to say. I'm just gonna use... Oh. I'm just gonna use a little bit of tune-up, keep the group going. Ah, uh, hurry up! Okay, uh, but again, lure doesn't really work here. I don't know if Wendy's inexperienced, or if they just have... problems. 
I don't know. It's just one of those tunes where I just question what is going on behind that computer screen. But congratulations, you're permanently cemented in this video of fighting the Deep Diver, which is super exciting, right? Wendy, Deep Diver's immune to everything right now. Wendy, please. Oh my gosh. Uh, they're fine. They're not like being mean or breaking any rules. I just think they don't understand the significance to this stuff. But it happens. It's it's just the way of life. If this was during a, like a, a big boss fight or something, I would have been a lot more concerned. I'm going to inspect you once this fight is over. Wait, what did, what did he say? Once this boss fight is over, observe you like an animal. Wendy, please speak so I know. There's a human playing. Yeah, does that sound reasonable? Oh my gosh. I think it's over. I, I don't even really eat Wendy's at all. Like, I've probably only had Wendy's, like, maybe twice in my whole life. Like, it's just not like any of the other fast food places I go. And we have to fight off more cogs, but whatever. Wendy, I beg of you, please. I need the tune-up points, so I'm just gonna use a little bit of tune-up. This was surprisingly more fun and more interesting than the last deep diver that you guys just saw just because of what was going on <laughs> i think it was actually really funny so anyways uh let, let's just see if we get any drops or anything yep good luck on drops let's see i didn't get any drops that's okay uh but let's see is wendy wow they have their their i can't believe they made it this far in the game <laughs> Oh, and Wendy got the sticker! Wendy got the, the Deep Diver sticker! Well, you know what? I could flex even harder. I can use this. Well, that was very interesting. Um, but anyways, I guess that's pretty much it for this video. This has been me <laughs> doing the Deep Diver with a very, very strange tune. What are they gonna do? They're just gonna stare off into space? Like something's going on? Wait, they're opening their book. What are they doing? This is like a wildlife documentary. They're like looking into their book. Now they're just standing. They're moving around. They're coming towards me. I need to teleport away. No, 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 they're not gonna find me. No, you're not gonna take me alive. No, they just phased right through me. That doesn't mean that they're not gonna take me with them. <laughs> Well, anyways, that is pretty much it for this video. This is me fighting the Deep Diver. I believe the next street that I have to go to is... I think it's Ye Old Toontown. I think that's the next one. Otherwise, it might be Daffodil Gardens. But I think it's... I think it's, uh... Ye Old Toontown, right? I think that's the next one, where I'll be fighting the Gatekeeper. So, anyways, that's pretty much it for this video. I appreciate everyone that chose to watch this. And again, do not forget to fight or not fight, but buy the Duck Shuffler plushie because it will be going away pretty soon and I'm not sure if there's going to be an extension on it or not. There probably will because sometimes extensions do happen with Makeship, but we'll see. So anyways, I will see you guys in the next video and have a good day, guys.